Today in noon, it is Mask Off New Orleans. The city leads the state with the most vaccinations and cases dropped significantly since this fourth wave. That's why Mayor Latoya Cantrell lifted the indoor mask mandate, which officially starts today. It comes right before a busy weekend. We've got football and, of course, Halloween. WDSU's Harrison Golden joins us live from Jackson Square this afternoon. Harrison, I know you talked to some people today about this mask mandate. What are you hearing so far? Yeah, Christina, some mixed opinions. Those, of course, who say that it is about time they get rid of this mask mandate. They say a lot of tourists, a lot of locals here in the French Quarter in particular say this is one less thing they're going to have to carry around. And it does indicate, in their words, an end or close to an end to the pandemic, at least the closest that they have seen yet to some light at the end of the tunnel. But we spoke with one epidemiologist who told us moments ago don't throw those masks away just yet. Dr. Susan Hassock is an epidemiologist at Tulane. She says there have been a few times in this pandemic when governments and certain bodies have ended certain mandates too soon. And that has led case counts to rise in the immediate future thereof. She stresses that just because the mandates are gone, the need to protect yourself remains. We all have the capacity to take actions that will provide us with some level of protection. And the first is foremost is, of course, vaccination. Next is wearing a mask in any kind of, of indoor crowded situation. And then third, you know, choosing when to enter into those kinds of crowded circumstances or situations. Now, again, just because there is no mandate in place doesn't mean different places can't come up with their own mask wearing rules. Schools, public schools here in Orleans Parish still require mask wearing. Uh, folks still need proof of vaccinations across the city to walk in or either proof of vaccinations or a negative COVID test to walk into any sort of businesses or public venues here in New Orleans. And again, some businesses have the rights to establish their own rules, whether or not they should be letting people, customers in with wearing masks without them that's still a possibility a lot of these places have their own rules in place we'll go to one coming up when i see you later this afternoon but for now we are live in jackson square harrison golden wgsu news